All right, what is up? We're gonna be doing some some real talk today. Just talking about my experience with Destiny 2 right now, and why I'm probably just gonna switch over to Siege. I mean, the main reason is just the lack of content. I'm basically just running pretty bad guns and having to play like a lot of rumble matches to get some good clips and stuff and edit them together. And uh, it's it's a lot of work. Like if I were to use a loadout like this all the time, I could just like I, I'd win nine out of ten rumble lobbies all the time. Like, I would basically never lose. Them. I have to be matched against a really good player. Like even, uh, what's his name? That one greasy YouTube streamer. Yeah, w wish you luck. That This dude's like, every time I match against him, he's gone after like the first couple of times I kill him because he thinks I'm hacking apparently. I even got kicked out of my own freaking clan, Remnant, because they thought I was hacking. Because I matched one of the clan mates and just destroyed him. And then he just accused me of hacking in clan chat and then like investigated me. I have 92% sniper rate for accuracy in Trials of Osiris. And it's, a, it's like 80% in Crucible, and they thought that was a giveaway that I was cheating, but that just proves that I try harder when I'm in a competitive game mode, and I actually try and accurately hit my snipes, which apparently is a crime. Like, headshotting people in Destiny, consistently hitting headshots is literally, you're just hacking. That's how Destiny 2 works right now. So let's just get into another match, and we'll, we'll keep discussing. Alright, we got Pacifica this time. So continuing what I was saying before, uh, this game's just kind of toxic now. Like, uh, every, you get accused of cheating all the time. Like, at first it's kind of funny and you kind of take it as a compliment that people think you're that good to the point that you're, that they think you're cheating. But, uh, after a while it's actually kind of like, I don't know, it's kind of sad. <laughs> no one actually thinks I'm like a real player. I'd kind of like, enjoy being appreciated for being good at the game. But according to everyone, I'm just cheating. Oh, bro, how'd you not kill me? Unlucky. And it's just kind of stupid, but uh, another big problem with the game, there's so many greasy, like, sweaty players. Like, whenever I'm trying out new guns, which I, I, that's basically all I do now is try out new weapons, and then make YouTube videos on them. I get lobbies where there's just, like, a bunch of greasy guys running, like, a hand cannon and a shoddy, just, like, sweat pouring down their faces. They're running around, like, they're, they have heavy breathing, they're like, come on, how did he get, like, they're like, that, like, that's them, and they're like, it's like, why am I, what am I playing this for? Like, Destiny's not that competitive of a game, outside of Trials, but apparently it's becoming that now. Like, everyone just wants to pub stomp and win every lobby, which is kind of sweaty and greasy. And, like, if I wanted to, I can just do this, run around and win every game. And that's what I did at the start of the season. It was fun. I don't get how people don't get tired of doing this. Like, no one wants to try new things in this game. And it makes it tough to make high-quality, premium, premium-quality videos my my epic audience but uh like a game like siege which i kind of want to move to once this new season comes out they're making a lot of changes that game's actually meant to be competitive and i enjoy being competitive but not when i'm not in the competitive game mode and trying to use goofy weapons for like a fun video it's kind of it's kind of aids and it's really frustrating i can still do really good like i obviously get really good clips and stuff all the time like at some point i hate hunters <laughs> At some point, I, can, I can't I can have another guy worm husk crown and get all of his health back around a corner. At some point, I gotta stop. I can't... I hate worm husk crown, man. And all these filthy titans. Thank God Anteus Wards went away. I don't know if I could have lasted with that piece of junk ruining the Crucible. That's another problem with Destiny, just like the meta. Right now, it's the best it's been in a long time, because at least you have like auto rifles and hand cannons as an option. And shotguns and snipers are both very viable. Snipers are almost too viable at this point. The flinch is not strong enough. I think snipers do need like an increase to their flinch because you can't... The amount of times you're like lighting someone up and they still hit you anyway is kind of annoying. Oh, he was on top of the box? Good play. And like, also, look at this. Look at this lobby. There's four people in here. Uh, either they're disconnecting, which they finally got a, a hold over. They're, people were just disconnecting constantly. Or they're just rage quitting because I'm pooping on their faces. That's usually what it is. I'm not even in like full lobbies at the time. How am I supposed to play this game if everyone's leaving on me? I don't know. It's just kind of, it's tough. It's very tough to make a video on this game. It's also tough to make a video on Siege though because I'm not as good at that game as I am at Destiny. I got another strafe going on. So like, I, I kind of struggle to get content in Siege. And that game's a lot more slower paced. So I need to do a lot more edits and like the videos will be shorter. So I don't know. I just don't know. I really enjoy making videos for this game because I'm actually really good at it. And I can use basically anything 
and do really good. Stop worm husk grinding, bro. This is the problem with this game. I hit him with my melee, which does like 100 damage, and he still survived. That means I did like, what, 146? No, 136. What is it? 236 damage to this idiot, and he still lives because he pressed the dodge button. Like, that, that shouldn't be a thing. Worm husk grinding is like a terrible concept for an exotic. Absurd. Oh, I'm dead as hell. Thanks for not putting down my healing rift. Appreciate it. Thankfully, he just used his dodge. This guy is greasy. He's sliding everywhere. Stop spamming worm husk crown, dude. This lobby's just a couple of hunters with worm husk. This is the problem. I hate these goobers. Thought there might be another guy. Also, all these people running around with black talon, hammerhead, like these these exotics that get like a million heavy ammo when you pick up heavy. I, I hate it. They can get like black talon can get you like six kills throwing that projectile. It's absurd. Oh damn. And hunters with their melees, man. Their their smoke bomb, their wombo combo. I'm getting meleeed. My screen's getting disoriented. I lose sensitivity and everything. Come on, Bungie. What is this AIDS? I don't need to deal with this. Obviously, Warlocks, we're firing a melee across the map, but we only have like one viable super. All we have is top three Dawnblade. Hunters have some variety. I am at Bonds! What am I doing? This guy's outplaying me with that, uh, the boost. I can't read where he's gonna be. Let's get back in the fight here. I don't know. If anyone has any ideas for vids, hit me up. I've done a lot of the uh, guns in this game right now. There's not much left for me to do, but if you got anything, I'd like to know. Okay, that guy was very delayed. That was weird. Why can't I, like, track this guy? I feel like I have latency right now. This guy's actually demolishing me. I've barely even like beaten him in the second half of this match. I've been farming lag 15. Right, let's head into the next one. I'm just not trying to get freaking sniped here or something. They're aped. Yikes. Oh, I have to reload right now. Nice. And, and okay, sprint please. Yeah, this game's just kind of buns right now. And if I slide one more freaking corner, hit all my shots, and then have someone freaking snipe me, I I'm done. <laughs> if that happens one more time, I'm out. I just can't have that. Like, you slide a corner and you hit your two headshots with your dire, and you're about to hit them with the third, and then they just snipe you. What are you supposed to do? Like, snipers are absolutely out of control right now. They've become so much easier. Like, I remember Forsaken, it was actually like, you were a god if you could really master the sniper. But they've just become so easy to use. Oh, my freaking shotgun name is balls right now. What's happening? First shows my hand cannon, and now I've collapsed in the shotgun department. Get crapped on. We got another dude coming in for cleanups. There's a high likelihood that that guy would freaking stop me there. That's the problem with this game. Screw hunters and their smokes, man. I hate hunters so much. They're so greasy. All their melees are like these insane abilities. Titans are out here just like punching people. Yeah, I can't complain though. The celestial fire is absolutely absurd. You can just like sh kill titans through their barricades too, which I think is completely random. I'm, I'm not complaining about it, but it's freaking random. Doesn't really make much sense. Oh, hold on, guys. Wait, what? I failed my accuracy stash there. Jesus. This guy just left? He's had enough of me? Alright. I'm really derping out right now with my aim. Kinda sucks. Get crapped on. Did I just kill this guy? Go away. Oh, get crapped on. Supers are a little bit out of control still. 
think the biggest problem with supers right now is the freaking stupid nerf they did to snipers. Right before trials came out, Bungie had the, the bright idea to reduce, to like make 140s terrible by making them not double body. And then making 180s, or not 180s, 90 RPM snipers like the beloved, the adaptive frames, not one shot headshot supers. They're like, they just want, they're like, you know what? Let's just make the Revoker the best sniper in the game. Let's just guarantee that that thing is the only thing used. And what do you know? It's literally like the only thing that's used in trials. Along with three peeking. Three peeking? Are you kidding me, Bungie? Why do you get to go in third person when you don't have ammo on your sword? And don't allow people to emote in, in game. Like, I, I don't know what else to tell you. The it, emotes just don't even have a place in trials. It's a competitive game mode. Why would you even need to emote? Like, I, just, I guess BMing, they want that to be a thing, but people can just teabag if they want to, all right? Don't allow emotes and trials while in the match. And then when you don't have sword ammo, you can't three peek. It's first person until you get ammo on your sword. Which should be an okay change for PvE too. It doesn't matter for PvE. I guess it would hurt people when they want to do their little like, you have to use like a sword with no ammo sometimes to get in certain spots. But you can do that without being in third person. You don't need to be in third person for that. But I'm going on like a major rant right now. I don't even know how they'd really fix that problem with three peeking. That's a tough one. Like, I don't know if they actually can remove emotes from a certain game mode. That's another problem with Destiny. I feel like their engine is kind of buns. I, I think they have to put in like a lot of work to do minor changes because like everything gets affected when they do something. So that, that would be like the only reason for like a Destiny 3. But I just saw some like Houndish video and he was talking about why Beyond Light is essentially Destiny 3. Apparently they're, they're really going hard on like rebuilding how these destinations function that they're putting in the content vault and like Europa will function differently. Not not to like our to our eyes or whatever, but like through like the code or whatever, they're gonna be able to do more intense things, like higher player counts and like the patrol by areas and like I, I don't know. He was talking about a bunch of wacky stuff. But if they do something like that, that'd be cool. Like really just improving the game's engine and their ability to like actually release patches and make changes faster that don't break everything in the game. Anyways, let's go to the next match and continue this. All right, we're here in our fourth and probably final match for this vid. The end of the rant. I don't know what else to talk about. I don't really remember what I've exactly talked about. I'm not on a script or anything. Oh, here's our, here's another problem. Wisdom. This guy has been in my last three matches, I think. Go away, please. I, I don't like you. I don't want you here anymore. Like, I, I'm pretty sure there's a larger variety of players I can be playing against right now due to the removal of skill-based matchmaking, but you still get put in lobbies with just like one to three of like the same people from the lobby before like i get it maybe the lobby played out good and you want to keep the people together but no go to hell put me in a lobby with new players so i can experience new things and adapt to new situations this guy just played he's literally robotic he's just your typical greased up hunter jumping around like a freaking fool oh great now i'm getting fourth partied what the hell was that guy doing just jumped in here and just didn't even pay attention to me. Yeah, I figured he would do that to me. We live though. That's hype. We gotta skirt on out of here for a second. Let's mark this guy. Is there some dude up in here? Is this wisdom? Okay. Tried to wombo me. Typical greased up hunter. Suck my nuts. Is there a dude up here? Oh, he yeah, maneuvered me good. I actually almost got off a second shot, but he decided to go with the hand cannon shot instead of melee me again. Smart move. Let's merc this guy. I oh, know. Don't get away and get cleaned up, please. Wait, oh, did you kill the guy? Oh. I thought he was still in the fight. Never mind. Is there some guy up here? Oh, some guy behind me. Oh no, it's my boy. It's my favorite, my favorite hunter. All right, what is going on here? Where did wisdom go? Oh, we had to reload. <laughs> bruh. That's actually a bruh moment. That's pretty disorienting, looking up like that. Oh, we, we made it happen. So for some reason, I can't three-tap Wisdom. He's just too powerful. I'm like intimidated by his powers. But I'm just crapping on everyone else. 
That, that happens a lot. I play really bad against good players sometimes. Other times I just play on like another level. But that's, that's another problem with me. I'm just extremely inconsistent in this game. I'm, I'm good some days. Amazing other days. And then terrible. Not terrible, but like not great. Ah, uh, that guy's buns. A good player would have flicked on him and we would have traded there. I ain't complaining though. What are you doing here, bud? Are you not aware of me being here? Are you just gonna run away for the next five minutes? Alright. Nice. Oh, this guy's heart scoping. Oh yeah, heart scoping lanes. That really hurts this game. Just like all these people in trials that will just like they three peek with their sword, they don't see anyone for a while, they come out and they just hit their scope them with their sniper for like the next minute. Until someone walks out. It really slows down the game mode. Three peeking especially. You just know that people are watching you. And you know you can't push. It's a huge issue. Alright, let's, let's get on to the action here. Yeah, see that are kids. Oracle Coil is super strong too, but not as strong as all these other heavies that get like a ton of ammo. I don't know why you get increased ammo in Rumble. I feel like they're just like trying to help the people that are pop stopping the lobby. So they're obviously going to be the ones to get heavy most of the time. So they beat everyone. Get out of here, Wisdom. Hopefully I don't kill up with this guy again, but uh, I don't know. Let's head to orbit here. Wrap this video up. It's a different vid. I don't normally ever do this. I've never really done this before. But, uh, I don't know, I just wanted to voice some of the issues with this game. Primarily, is the biggest problem with this game is just the community. It's all these people that will accuse you of hacking once they get headshot once. And they, uh, they three-peak in trials all the time. People running around with the mountaintop. The mountaintop, please, dear God, just delete the gun from the game. I got the gun. I grinded it out before the quest even got made easier. I did it when it was really difficult. Just remove the gun from the game please that gun sucks it's so i hate that gun <laughs> but uh, yeah it's just all these people in rumble that are still running like dire promise volunteers like i just was they just they do that every day they just get in they get on get on rumble play all day pub stomp people where's the fun in that try a new gun like i'm out here trying to use all these goofy weapons for videos and like i'm just getting crapped on by these guys trying extremely hard a lot of times i'm able to still pull through anyway but like the videos i don't do good enough in the game to actually use it so it's just a waste of my time but uh that's probably gonna be it for today's video if you enjoyed me uh talking a lot <laughs> like and subscribe but uh i'm out